Researchers in Antarctica from the University of Chile, the Chilean National Museum of Natural History, and the University of Texas at Austin have discovered the second largest egg and the largest dinosaur egg in history. The fossil was first uncovered on Seymour Island in 2011, but it took almost a decade to analyze the find. Resultó ser eh, este saco, un, era un saco, una estructura como un balón de fútbol, si se quiere, eh, totalmente desinflado. Entonces era con un, tenía unos pliegues muy extraños. En realidad, en ese momento con Rodrigo no, te, no tuvimos la menor idea de qué podía hacer. They weren't quite sure what they were looking at, but the scientists had a hunch, which led them to bringing the fossil to the Chilean National Museum of Natural History, where it spent almost a decade in the archives. In 2018, University of Texas at Austin paleontologist Julia Clark suggested after visiting the museum that it could be a squashed soft egg. Pensemos en dinosaurios y sus descendientes las aves, en cocodrilos, en tortugas, que la mayoría de ellos ponen huevos que son duros, o sea, tienen la cáscara dura. Mientras que por otro lado, en los reptiles lepidosaurios, la tendencia, la mayoría es que son eh, huevos blandos porque la capa calcárea más externa que la que le da la dureza al huevo es extremadamente reducida. Tests revealed that the fossil was indeed an egg and, at about 6.5 kilos and 29 centimeters across, is second in size only to the Madagascar elephant bird egg. Eh, la evidencia empuja a, a que se trata de un lepidosaurio grande y los lepidosaurios grandes que abundan como fósil en esa isla y en ese ambiente son los mosasaurios. Por lo tanto, creemos, pensamos, que es un huevo de mosasaurio. The mosasaur was a giant reptilian that lived more than 66 million years ago in Western Europe, North America, South America, and Antarctica, and had adapted to living in water.